Well, we were just talking about how um, uh, there used to be this organization that would buy wines from wineries in large quantities, and investors would buy them, and they would sit on an agent for, I forgot what it was, four or five years, and then mm -hmm. they would try and resell the, the, the wines to restaurants, and they went out of business, which is a shock. <sighs> Really, it was, it was great for Wine of the Month Club because and this oh. is probably 15, 20 years ago. We bought a lot of great wines that really inexpensively, but the concept was good. Well, but just... the concept was good. The problem was they didn't do, they didn't get very good wines. They, yeah, well, they, that's you know, I mean, yeah, they were good at the prices that the Wine of the Month Club sold them for, but not at the prices they wanted for them. They went bankrupt. They went... Well, if you're gonna if you're a restaurant, and you're gonna buy an aged wine from somewhere, and you're gonna try to present it to the public as an aged wine. It better be pedigreed. Noticeable wines That's and right. say, "Oh, wow, this is really you know." But they, is, none of them were. None of them were. They're <laughs> great wine. This is uh, I love this little round. You know, round Hill's been around for a while. This is Rutherford, uh, was it Rutherford Bent, Rutherford Hill. That wasn't a that wasn't a play on words. They've been around for a while. They've been round this, Hill. For they've a been while. a square for a while. Right. So uh, yeah, this is a really really old company that um, has deep roots. I mean, I remember Round Hill in the 70s, okay? They've been around. And they're still around, and they're around still making Hill. great value wines. $13.99 on the shelf, $6.99 in the reorder price. Is that around? No, it's really more like a pair. Yeah. Actually, <laughs> I, know, I'm, 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 I lost another five Did pounds you? last week. Oh, good so, job. So, um, this... Uh, now Ooh, this oak. is this is the, I'm just gonna say this is not the typical Chardonnays we've been uh, featuring lately. This has got a little bit more wood in it, which is not at the cusp for me, but still for you guys that like oak, you're gonna get your your oak fix. Here. It's got good acid. Though. It's got very good acid. Well, they're a good winery. I mean, they make they make good solid value wines. Always have. Ninety four for me. Could be a ninety five, but I already gave one out. I'll do a ninety three just to be different, but it's really a. Oh jeez, that's it's got oak. <laughs> 